Hi, it is I, the Bowtie Guy, and welcome back to Undertale. Hey, Gabe, are you still wearing that Power Ranger suit? Oh, hey, did you also notice that everything else is at the same lighting? And my hair is still this? That's because I'm still playing, I just wanna have room for editing. Anyway, let's just continue. Warning, dog marriage. Wait, what? Lesser dog appears. Act, uh... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Lesser dog. Attack 12. Defense 2. Wields a strong dog. <laughs> stone dogger made of pup. <laughs> oh no. Hey. You better lift <laughs> lifted your hand and lesser dog got excited. Tiny bar. Hey. You, sl you sl uh, lightly touch the dog. It's. <laughs> It's already overexcited. You pet the dog. It raises its head to meet up you. <laughs> you pet the dog. It was a good dog. <laughs> it's excitement. <laughs> Critical pet. <laughs> the dog. <laughs> the dog excitement increased. <laughs> you have to jump up to pet the dog. Yeah, I would think. <laughs> pet. <laughs> you didn't even pet it. It gets more excited. Ready <laughs> take off. <laughs> there is no way to stop this madness. Kettle whistle. Let's <laughs> your dog into the realm of the clouds. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you, you call the dog, but it's too late. It cannot hear you. Oh no, it's off the screen. Oh no, that tail is off the charts. Far away bark. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm too amused about this. Okay, gotta calm down. Gotta breathe. Gotta think. I'm just. Unless your dog has gone where no dog has gone before. Unless your dog is beyond your reach. Okay, yeah, I, I, I think that's enough. Oh my god, that's so much gold. So, um, I think I found my favorite part of this entire game. I can guarantee you won't find gameplay like that anywhere else. Hello! I don't have a name. What's that smell? What's that smell? Or, or, hold on. What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're if you're a smell, identify yourself. Jazzy. Hmm. Here's our weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. <laughs> Doggy assaults you. Oh. Sorry, I, I like that. Check. Dogami. Attack 14. Defense 5. Husband of dog, <laughs> dog arrest up. Knows only what he smells. You roll around and just, uh, no, you smell like a weird puppy. Don't touch my hot. <laughs> oh, wait, you know what? No, I changed my mind. You want to get sick? You threw the stick and the dogs ran to get it. You played fetch for a while. Let's kick a uh, human tail. Do humans even have tails? No, we don't! Every dog loves to play fetch. Can I mercy them? Yep, that's what I thought. You earn 40 gold! Weird smells can bring good things. Friendly fun fetch. <laughs> Thanks, weird smell. It sure was fun to stick around. Ah, oh, the puns! Ah! Oh. <laughs> what? How did you avoid my trap? And, more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Left it. Really? Wowie! You resisted the flavor of my home cooked pasta just so you could share it with me. Fret not, human! I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you as. make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> <laughs> Wait! Oh! Stop switching it with me! <laughs> okay, that's a wee bit difficult there, laddie. 
Okay. Oh, you left. Okay, that's cool. I'll just solve your puzzle for you. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking up, <laughs> taking care of him. Yeah. Oh, hey. Okay, what's going on over here? Human! Hmm. How do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look uh, the snow to look more like my face. <laughs> Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different, and as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I am saying is, worry not, human. I, the Great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. So, whatever is Okay, gotcha. So, you want a hint, huh? Well, I've been looking at the puzzle, and I think the solution is to turn all the X's into O's. You should try that. Asking again for more great hints. Oh, okay. Yeah, I remember this puzzle now. Oh crap. Okay, that's just to show that I could do it, but what is it here? There's a switch on the trunk of this tree. Press it. Wow! You solved the puzzle! My advice helped! You really helped you! It really helped you! Oh my! Incredible! I'm impressed! You must care about puzzles like I do! Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you! <laughs> oh my gosh! Sorry, it's not so much! <laughs> and then you gotta change it up on me! <sighs> oh, hi, Sans. Good job at solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help, which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Hey, it's the human. You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. Sorry, I thought you were gonna say papyrus, so I got kind of thrown off there. <laughs> you see these tiles? What? Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are warm tiles. Swim, swim through if you like, but if you smell oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Finally, pink tiles. Oh my god. <laughs> they don't do anything! Step on them all you like! How was that, understand? <sighs> I do not want to read that out loud again. I'm sorry. Of course! Great! Then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random! When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before! Not even I will know the solution! <laughs> Get ready! <laughs> Actually, that spaghetti from earlier, it wasn't too bad to, for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something even. <laughs> Fair enough. Seems like the base of a snow dog. It's the broken head of a snow dog. It's the broken head of a snow dog. 
bass, right? Bass, yep. Let me guess, bass too. On the floor inside is a box of pomeranzes. A word of dog. Please pet dog. <laughs> Alright, let me talk to you for a bit. A dog just oh, a dog just rushed in here, filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed its own emotions. <laughs> but as it built, it kept getting more excited about the soldier. Its neck got longer and longer, and it added more and more snow until it was rather sad to watch, but <laughs> I couldn't turn away. <coughs> Knowing the dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination. <laughs> oh my god. And that's it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like it, like it. If you'd like to see the rest of the Undertale playlist, click over here. If you'd like to see the latest video from me, click over there. And don't forget to subscribe up there. And I shall see you next time. Bye!